What's up guys? The reason why I'm making this video is in regards to the question that was posted on one of my videos uh, that I posted a few weeks ago. Uh, this question was asked by Vicky Vadav. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. He wanted to know the right technique for cross bench pullovers targeting the upper chest, the lats, and the triceps of the secondary. Now, this is my opinion about um, cross bench pullovers. I used to do cross bench pullovers a while ago. In fact, it used to be one of my favorite upper chest, lat, tricep exercise. But I found out a few years ago, every time I do this exercise, you know, I always have a sharp pain a few days later around my chest and front and in back. So I went to my chiropractor and he always asked me, how come your knee, you knock your ribs out? What were you doing? Why, how did you knock your ribs out? Um, I didn't know that the cross bench pullover that I was doing was the one that was creating this issue. And so I do not do cross bench pullovers anymore. Um, because every time I do it, you know, the stress on your ribs because the bench is not wide enough to cover your whole upper back. Now I'm going to show you the reason why I don't do this anymore. So I have a dumbbell here. So I'm going to go on the other side. So I'm going to sit right about there. So as I put my chest, my back across the bench, and as I'm lowering the dumbbell, to pull up like that. I'm gonna do that one more time because I don't wanna do this too much. Lower and I pull back. So what's happening is that I'm feeling a lot of stress right around my upper back, right around my upper ribs. I can feel the stress in between those areas and if you're using a heavier dumbbell, even if you're using a lighter dumbbell, yeah, the compression is just way too much. And for me, um, if the risk of the exercise outweighs the benefit, um, I'm gonna scratch that exercise. So I do not do cross bench pullovers anymore because of this issue. So if you're gonna still do cross bench, instead of doing cross bench pullovers, I would rather do a flat bench pullover. So what I would do is grab the same dumbbell, and now fall back this way, feet up, head back. So you want to pull back right about there, feel the stretch, and then you pull back up this way, right there. Right about there, feel the stretch on the lat, and then you pull back like that. I'm going to do one more. Reach back, feel the stretch, and then pull back up. So, if you're gonna do, if you're gonna do instead of doing cross bench pullover with a dumbbell, I want to do a regular flat bench pullover because it's much more safer, no stress, um, compression going between your upper ribs, which will eventually knock your ribs out. And one more caution: if you have any shoulder injuries, um, history of shoulder problems or shoulder dislocation. Be careful with this exercise because it will put a lot of stress on your shoulders. And so be careful so you don't do this exercise if, you're, if you have a shoulder dislocation or you know, issue with shoulder problems or labrum tear or rotator cuff problems. So I hope I'm able, I've been able to answer your question, Vicky. I do not do cross bend pullovers anymore because of the issue of knocking the ribs out. So I'd rather do it flat this way. You're still going to feel the same effect without putting yourself at risk of knocking your ribs out. So there you have it, Vicky. So I hope you're gonna take good caution in not stressing your ribs out just because you wanna do a cross bench pullover. Remember, you guys should remember, these exercises that we all copying and doing, it was invented by people. Someone came up with this exercise. You can come up with any kind of exercise. I remember the Arnold Press, you know, Arnold came up with this. And just because someone came up with it, just it doesn't mean that this exercise is for you. You know, make sure you use caution. And if you can do it without knocking your ribs out, that's fine. But it's just the stress on the ribs is just way too high. So this is why I don't do these cross bench pullovers anymore. I rather do the flat bench 
pullovers with my feet up on the bench. So there you have it, Vicky. I hope I've, I've been able to answer your questions. Before I sign out, please go to MiamiMuscleUSA.com and register and be a member today and get all the blueprints you need when it comes to getting your body and your health and your fitness to the highest level. If you're not a subscriber yet, please subscribe below. And if you're already a subscriber, you can ding that bell right there and um, I'll notify you whenever I put on a new video. So this is Mojuolo Ulua from Miami Muscle. Before I sign out, in fact, I'm signing out right now, I'm gonna go back and hit my flat bench pullovers with a dumbbell. There we go. Feet up on the bench.